terms, negative 8 and f and the last terms, negative 8 and 4. All right, so first, 7f times f. Sounds like some of your report cards, 7f, 7f. Okay, Nick, 7f times f. 7f squared. Seven F times four. Brooke. Twenty eight F. Twenty eight F. Wrong. Negative eight times F. Kaylee. Negative eight F. And negative eight times four. Aubrey. Kristen, help her out, please. Mm -hmm. Negative eight times four. <laughs> Jackie, please. Thank you. All right. Now, the outside and the inside terms get simplified, so these two go together. That's going to give you 20F. Then we just add up the parts. 7f squared plus 20f plus negative 32. All right, let's finish this. 7. Now, the only reason I put 7 there is because it's got a fraction. It has a tendency to mess with people's heads. Doesn't matter that there's a fraction there, it's part of the numbers. The numbers still get multiplied in the same old way. It doesn't impact the problem in any way, shape, or form. So, first thing we do, same thing we've done all the problems, change subtraction into adding the opposite. So you got one third x plus four plus three x plus negative nine. All right, so we're gonna go for the firsts here, our one third x and three x. Outside terms are third x and negative nine. Inside terms are four and three x. Last terms, four and negative nine. Now, as far as a third of x times three x, a third of three is just one. And then you got the x times the x, which is x squared. So as you can see, the fraction didn't make a whole hill of beans there anyway. We came out with a whole number. Same thing's going to happen in the next one. A third of 9 is 3, but then you just stick the negative in front of it, so you come up with negative 3x. So again, the fraction went away. So the fractions didn't do anything for us at all, other than make us have to think a little bit harder about the multiplication. 4 times 3x is 12x. Nine and ne uh, negative 9 and 4 make negative 36. Now, once again, these outers and inners can go together. Negative 3x and 12x make 9x. And then you just run the parts together. 1x squared plus 9x plus negative 36. Uh... <sighs>